What's going on guys, Mac Junkie here. Welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to fix Google or any other internet browser you have when it just doesn't seem to be loading sites. Uh, sometimes some sites might load and other sites won't load. And uh, so in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to fix that. So uh, I was recently fixing a computer, one of my friend's computers, and um, he gave me the complaint that uh, nothing would load. So I brought his computer home. I thought that there might be something wrong with the Wi-Fi chip in his laptop. But uh, it turned out Wi-Fi was fine. He just had a proxy enabled. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to disable your proxy if you do have one. And sometimes you may not know of uh, a proxy or if you set one up. Sometimes apps can do this on their own and then mess up your browser. So go down to your Windows search bar and type in settings. And then open up settings and then type in proxy. There we go. And then go to change proxy settings. And now for me, I just have everything turned off because proxies are uh, useless to me and I do not use them. And I recommend that you turn them off too. Sometimes this might be turned on or even sometimes your manual proxy might be turned on and that will stop you from using the internet properly. So after you do that, if that fixes the problem, then great. But if not, then there might be some problems with your DNS. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna flush the DNS. You're gonna go back to your Windows search bar and type in CMD. And when this little box comes up here, you are going to type up here. You're going to type in IP config and then hit the space bar and then do a forward slash and then type in flush DNS, just like that. Hit enter and it will say Windows IP configuration successfully flushed the DNS resolver cache. And now all you have to do is close out of there and restart your computer. Once you restart your computer, try to access those websites that were working or that were not working before and see if they load. So anyways, guys, that's it for this video. Really quick tutorial. Hopefully it helped you guys out. If it did, please be sure to leave a like. If you liked it a lot, subscribe as well, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.